video before. This was originally going this could have been technically episode four. But I'll call it episode three because this is actually my second attempt on making it cause reasons. By the way, I continued the subscribe aka season one alongside season two. This is my second time trying to video this because I already know what's gonna pop up. The first two things are gonna be my maxes. And then ah oh, seems to have changed. Yep. Now I know that I shouldn't go to it. Oh yeah. Oh wait. First, first, are built to tower above the rest. I can actually see my bite stack while I know it's going up. Yes. the most imposing creature yet. I'm hoping to use Porky Pains later. Porky Pains are like these spit things that give a level 5 spit. 
My arms hang down at the ground. Nah. I need to have long arms and legs so that I can tower above everything else. The only thing they can hit now are my legs. And even if they do destroy my legs, I still have four limbs left. This is technical, I could still move. This thing is a real thing and I could actually die. If I could actually lose limbs, I mean. If I could actually lose limbs in this game, then, uh, then I'd be able to still move because of my gigantic arms. Yes, yes. My creature could speed across the lands and had the finest climbing skills except that I have to be stealthy and quick. I, I added two more onto the death camp, so it's currently 24. This is in case you don't know, or you probably actually don't if I can ever say this um, video. But uh, I, I work on this game. Well, I didn't know. But I worked on this game quite a bit. And, yeah, I, mean, I, I was about to put a in my brain. in all four traits. And due to be me being more imposing for I am the judge. No! Wait, Pan Looper? That's not what attacked me last time. So Pan Looper is a little thing. Wait, I was in the back I'm just gonna... I don't have to be that close to eat my prey. <clears throat> nah. Alpha Pan Loopers. in that gigantic period of time. I had like five seconds to eat. It's 25. Here's the thing, here's the thing. No one should miss. The reason I lied is because of the animation. I'll show you. It's gonna get a lot harder. You know what this calls for? Destroying the very thing that killed me. The pan group. Do you have a stick? You. Take stick. Now. Throw stick. Can you 
first again. My creature cannot unlock stealth for it is gigantic. We must run for the hills and stalk our person there. Uh, I I have I would literally have so many of my own creatures. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, why can I defend them? Ultras. Also, the Alphastra are going to die. Look, I completely randomized the names. Alphastra. Yeah, I'll just pick a random letter. Yeah, okay. It's annoying that they can double for me, but these are threatening me so I think it's good. Thankfully, my species is fast. Dorothy's, they're hard to win over. I'll just get one of my pack members to help me destroy them. Also, what's stopping me from eating things alive? Oh, well, that sounds bad. Remember, in this game, you have to shred through all that health just to regain all your health. So while you're almost dead, you need that just to heal. So in hindsight, you're actually only healing a couple of health during the kind of first week. Hmm. Oh, what happened here? Wait, what? Yeah. 
did they just materialize out of nothing? Uh, sure, I think they're all good. Maybe like a one more texture because I need some stay fresh. How can I improve on this page? First of all, I'm using unnecessary DNA points when it comes to this. Second of all, this. I'm capable of shooting for it only shows me due to what level of spit I'm on. So if I'm on level one spit but I have like 50 of them, oh well. It just won't enable the others to work. Cause that makes a logic sense in every way. And also Scare, scare, scar claw, scare claw. Don't know, but it seems good because. Also, I should probably think of doing getting some protection since literally the only thing to protect him. Hmm, what if I were to? Then make them huge. Maybe I'm thinking to fit at all, not more into the wide spectrum. Look, if this so far. Oh. If game of species dies out, that's my fault. the more into the sprint and speed trait. The Gekinator, as I've said in the past, is pretty good. Have I? That one I'm just thinking of something else. Second of all, handables. My creature may look dorky, but trust me. He is a formidable thing.
I mean, so far this dude looks like, so, like he's gonna be pretty successful. First, this dude's need. Now that I'm more gigantic, I should be pretty. I need to become a formidable opponent. Now, no nothing. Strong more than I don't know, maybe a gigantic horn, yeah. Yes, they are. Maybe I should try spacing them out a little bit more. Go to your neck. Now I look. Now my legs don't look big enough.
Go gamer. Or something I made. Toxic shred. Wait, this is the, the turf. The ball. All things are made. Robo Ultra. Robot I made. Colex. Three. Colex is another thing I made. Super gamer. Good. He could go really fast. Perfect creature. He had almost everything maxed out except for... things that go around it. Actually, mine looks, needs to look like he's armored. Now the okay, on this side is more Yeah. Oh yeah, the handle's good, it just takes a bit to turn. So this video is almost a half an hour, so just before let test drive on some real animals and see how formidable of the game. Oh! The next big event. My creation. Don't be disappointed in your egg. You are the one that forged this entire species. <laughs> Claiming your home base. <laughs> you wanna be in my pack? Oh no, it's on. Guys. We will be moving onward to a new era and our new home far, far away. That ends this episode. You can like, you can subscribe. That would help my channel grow and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.